How to make WWE 2K18 perform better on your PC? As I told you before in the previous video, I got two methods that will get the game run a hell lot better. This video, we talk about method 1. This one isn't as effective as the method 2, but if you're sure you're on a PC that can handle the game very well, then this is the method for you. However, if you feel like you're in a low spec PC, which may be below minimum requirements of the game as well, then you can apply method 1 and definitely method 2. But since it's about method 1, we'd like to talk about method 1. Especially for those who knows their PC is fast enough to run the game flawlessly, but for some reason they're not able to. Guys, this is gonna fix it. So let's start. So you gotta go to NVIDIA control panel. Now if you don't know how to go there, you just have to be on your main screen or your desktop, right click and you will find NVIDIA control panel. Just click on it and it'll pop up. Make sure you click on adjust image settings with preview, which can be seen on top left corner of your screen. Now, make sure you have selected use the advanced 3D image settings. Now click on manage 3D settings which is again on your left top corner of the screen. Now click on program settings and click add and then select your game.exe file and then just select add selected program. I would like to tell you that you have already done 90% of the work and your game should now have drastic changes when it comes to performance. Now the game is expected to run in a lot better frame rates than it was running before. However, if you would like to go on and take further steps then you might even get a lot better performance as well so you can continue the tutorial or you can just end it right there because 90% of the work has been done already if you wish to continue then keep watching this video so for the next thing to be done you need to head over to documents and inside documents you're gonna see a folder named WWE 2K18 you need to open that folder and inside that you are going to find a file named config just edit that file so you gotta make sure that your audience tessellation is off and simple lightning is on once you do that you can now close the notepad file and make sure to save the changes that you just made but you aren't done right now because now you need to make sure this file is on the read only mod you have to right click on the file again go to its property and below you will find read only just make sure it is checked and just hit apply and ok moving on to the third step now what you can do is you can head over to your control panel and you are going to find an option named power options click on there and make sure that high performance is checked in another thing that you can do is when you launch the game head over to con head over to task manager and uh, then click on details and you will see your game right there right click on that set priority to high and save it that should also give you some boost the last thing you can do is actually in the in-game settings so just launch your game wait for it to load then you go on to graphic settings and once the graphic settings are on your screen make sure vsync is on I don't know why it works but if it is on then it definitely helps and makes the game even better 
so guys these are few of the things that you can try and that will give you major boost in your gameplay performance however i would like to repeat this again if you feel like your pc isn't that powerful to to run the game then you have to wait for me to upload method number two because method number two is very effective and it can run your game too fast even on low spec pc so method number two would be uploaded soon stay tuned if you're new to my channel make sure to subscribe and like this video and wait for the next part